Cellulose fiber. What is cellulose fiber? It's a raw material used primarily to make paper. The good news is that cellulose fiber can be found everywhere. In the wood of every tree, in the stems of plants, cereal crops, sugarcane, etc. In the byproducts of the wood industry and agriculture. It can also be found in old paper and paperboard, which can be recycled. It is found around the world. Cellulose is the most abundant natural polymer on Earth. But what does cellulose fiber look like? Like the tiny threads you can see sticking out of this log. It makes up around 50% of dry wood. These fibers have one key property. They are extremely strong. Some are long, others are short. It depends on the type of tree. The fibers of hardwood trees are short. They produce lovely porous paper. This is ideal for printing because it allows ink to dry quickly. They are used in books, printer paper, and magazines. The fibers of resinous trees are longer and produce stronger papers. They are used to manufacture robust bags and packaging. But how can cellulose fiber be extracted from these logs or from the byproducts of the timber industry? While the little paper wasp has always removed them one by one, humans have more industrial processes. Thermomechanical, thermochemical, or waste paper and cardboard recycling. Paper can have up to seven lives. Regardless of the method, be it thermomechanical or thermochemical, the fibers obtained are brown. In some cases, there is an additional stage, bleaching. To sum up, paper manufacturers must first create the ideal mixture by combining long, short, unbleached, bleached, and recycled fibers in very precise proportions. All that remains is to add water. But that's another story. To find out more about cellulose fiber, contact us.